explore Gombe. Welcome to Gombe State, the jewel in the savannah, the rising star from the northeast. Gombe State was created 1st of October 1996 out of the former Bauchi State, covering a total area of about 20,265 square kilometers. The state has 11 local government areas and shares common boundaries with Bauchi, Borno, Yobe, Taraba, and Adamawa states of the northeastern geopolitical zone of Nigeria. The state has relatively about 18 local languages, vegetation that is predominantly of Guinea savanna type, and average rainfall from 700 mm southwest at the extreme northern part of the state to 1,000 mm towards the south and southwestern parts of the state. The state has so much to offer from natural beauty, historical heritage to cultural diversity. The capital is fast growing and in meeting the demands of the fast growing city, charming boutiques have opened, schools, universities for quality education, hotels for your decent accommodation and classy hospitality, bakeries, joints for hangouts, good restaurants, also that offer local and continental cuisine to cater for your indigenous and international taste. No doubt, your taste boards will have a story to tell when you pay one of these eateries a visit. When it comes to marketing, the state offers best opportunity for business to strive. With its rapid growing economy, not eastern central location, about 3.5 million population of consumers. It is an important target destination for local and foreign products and services. New modern markets and malls have also opened within the state. With recent discovery of crude oil in Kashiri and coal in Bojude, mineral resources tapped and yet untapped. The state is a potential hub for investors and investors stand to benefit from friendly investment government policies, comfortable atmosphere for business, quality roads, and airport linking the state to the rest of Nigeria and the world. Explore Gombe is the window where you see the abundant talents, natural beauty, cultural diversity, and historical heritage in Gombe. Explore Gombe. To connect you to Gombe from diaspora, to connect investors to Gombe, to connect tourist visitors to Gombe. We take a look into two years of unprecedented achievement of Governor Muhammad Inwaya Hayas administration and also the message of His Excellency to the people of Gombe State as we celebrate 25 years anniversary. Explore Gombe. Explore Gombe. Explore Gumbi. International Hotel. With regards to Gombe Hotels and Sanctuary, the Gombe State International Hotel remains as perhaps the best lodging for travel. It is great for families, couples, and solo voyagers. It has a peaceful climate for resting, with a standard pool, bar, cafe, tennis court, and a decent exercise center with standard hardware. The rooms are modest and reasonable. Assuming you need to encounter the gem in the savannah, then at that point, Gombe State International Hotel is energetically recommended for your stay. Gombe International Hotel. Um, my name is Radio Garba Sofian and uh, I am the general manager of Gombe International Hotel. Well, uh, I think uh, the hotel play key role in the development of uh, any given state uh, in the sense that uh, the, one of the cardinal achievements or aims of any government is to woo investors as well as uh, visitors who will come and help in the development of that state. 
Now, when they come to the state in response to the call of the chief executive to come and invest, they first look for a decent accommodation. And from the treatment of that hotel, they know that they are in a state to beat. So uh, ours is one that uh, whenever guests come, we first look at them as our own guests, not the government guests, because we are the first contact with them. And then by their stay with us, they feel okay and they know that they have come to the right environment or the right state and any other thing follows. Well, I think um, I have been in Gombe directly or indirectly for the past 25 years. And uh, I've been doing the hotel work. And uh, I think significantly the hotel has been faring very well. But most importantly, under the current administration. I said this because of a number of reasons. Uh, His Excellency Al Haji Muhammad Yahya has opened up the state to so many investors. So we have been having more visitors to the state than ever before. And then the enabling environment provided by the current administration in terms of stability, in terms of security, has also encouraged more hotels to come up. I want to assure you that within the past two, three years, there has been significant proliferation of more and more hotels in Gombe. So even the state government is currently coming up with a hotel in the Mega Park project. That is to tell you that the uh, business of the hotel is booming and uh, the environment is really benefiting from the existence of hotel. So many individuals have also gone into the hotel and that is to tell you that the environment is enabling. The governor has really provided an environment for this to happen. Well, uh, trust, when a guest check into the hotel and he finds the management and the staff doing what they expect, giving them value for money, certainly you have established confidence first then whatever they need, they get it at the right time they want it and the charges are affordable. And especially when they forget or they fail to do something and you remind them politely, you are establishing trust. We have cases where people forget their items, valuables, and they travel far away. We contact them and we make safe returns of those items to them. So I think that is our establishing trust. And in confidence, they come every time and they see changes, positive changes than they left the place before. Then you are establishing also confidence and trust in them to do business with you. I think uh, what guests want is good facility at affordable prices. And that is what we are here for, and that is what we provide them. And then anytime they meet the staff and there has been anything left behind, either in terms of forgetfulness or they couldn't go with it, anywhere they are, we trace their contact and we reach them. Sometimes we link up through Gombe Line or any fastest means and send it to them. So this has built a very good relationship between the hotel and its uh, customers. We, the message we want to send here, first and foremost, we need to thank God for giving us the person of His Excellency Al Haji Muhammadu in Yahya. This hotel has been in existence for 10 years now. Nobody has ever thought of renovating it. For the first time now, His Excellency, has seen the need to totally renovate the hotel for better. And this is going to raise the image of the state before the visitors to the state. And for the first time, he thought it wise to redirect the hotel's operation rather than allowing it to go under the bureaucratic process of ministry. He reconstituted 
and form and sign into existence an executive order granting the state revenue optimization company limited with is called Grocol and this is M at giving the hotel not only this all the hotels and other assets belonging to Gombe State a private sector orientation so that revenue more revenue will come to the state than before so i think uh, this is a very good thing that happened to the state therefore the message is for the people of gombe to see the hotels at their own property and then cooperate with his excellency in whatever he does in terms of providing dividends of democracy to the state at large and particularly when it comes to promoting the hospitality and tourism industry in the state. As Gombe celebrates the 25th anniversary of uh, statehood, uh, the management and the staff of the hotel wish to extend a very heartfelt goodwill message to His Excellency, Alhaji Muhammadu uh, Inouye and uh, his deputy, Dr. Manasa Daniel Jato. Uh, we here said every single day of their tenure has been eventful, has been purposeful, and uh, we cherish the leadership quality and uh, the prudent management of the state resources, the discipline he inculcated into the state services and affairs. So wish you more returns of this uh, anniversary and uh, we hope and pray that the people will have faith in him.